Hello, I am Madani Ariam. This is regarding my new online course, brand new online course, Discovering Accounting Strategies to Grow Your Business. This is Lecture 4 and Section 2. Watch out for hidden profit killers. Budgeting and keeping track of your expenses can keep you identity, identify the hidden expenses that are costing you money on a monthly basis. Periodically go through the, your budget and look at every major expense and ask yourself if the expense is truly contributing to the sources of your business. If not, you have to get rid of that expense. That's what it means. Staff expenses are the most obvious example of this and employees accruing over time. Employees accruing over time without delivering substantive results. If so, it may be time to reconsider the comp compensation arrangements. You have to stop the overtime. That's all about it. Also, look for things like underutilized equipment, some equipments we don't use it at all, excess inventory, that's important, and outdated or inefficient computing structure that may be hampering your productivity. Additionally, you should consider if office space is being utilized fully in the most profitable way possible and warranty expenses. Educating yourself about lean management and implementing a continuous improvement style cycle is one of the best ways to manage the challenges of growth and keep your profit strong. You have to learn the things, you have to invest in yourself. If you have a manufacturing business, take care of the excess inventory. Always make sure that you have the right amount by counting the stocks and reconciling with the purchase records. If there is a discrepancy, analyze the reasons for, his, for it as inventory is a major issue in the manufacturing process. If you fail to have the stock at, the, at some point, if a customer makes a huge order, you will not have the time to purchase and manufacture the item. Then what will happen is you have to turn down the order. As a result, you might lose the particular customer forever and the profit on that sale as well. Indirect cost. Inventory is a major item in an manufacturing company because the other expenses go along with it as well. Payment to the staff to purchase inventory and keeping it as a stock, warehouse. It must, if a mistake made in the order, you have to return the stock and lost your amount that you paid for the staff. In the meantime, taken to replace the correct stock might be too long and during that time you might lose some orders. Consider the cost of the staff helps to move around the stops, warehouse space, electricity, taxes and other expenses. The longer you leave your stock in the warehouse, the possibility get damaged or stolen. So these expenses will reduce your profit. Other indirect costs, insurance to cover the cost of the inventory in the event of an accident. The cost of obsolescence, old and revision changes, obsolete and revision changes. You have to revise and make changes. Accounting personnel paying the bills. System to track the inventory including computers and other hardware. All these are expenses. Opportunity costs, money tied up in an inventory cannot use for something else. Productivity effects. 
inaccurate inaccurate inventory only kill the profits but also have the bad effect on the productivity as well, as well. when you are ready to start to produce a product say product A you will look for the in in necessary parts and if you do not find it the production is delayed you get your staffs to look for it and then go out to buy that in the meantime you would you would lose all the staff's wages and the delay in production and the profit is also killed the more you delay you lose more money as you cannot fulfill the demands cash flow the accuracy of the accounting records affect the cost of the inventory if the records show that you do not have a particular item then you what you will do you will go and order the item without knowing that particular item is still with you therefore this error made due to the inaccuracy in the accounting records cash flow shows the amount that you have the we have spent on purchasing a particular stock nevertheless if you do not update your cash flow when the item taken out and used for some production it will remain in the cash flow as a purchase these are the things will reduce your profit so you got to take care you got to be aware of these things and expect all the problems in in advance and try and solve it as quickly as possible to not to lose your profits i hope you understood these tips these are the killer items in profits in profit making so you i hope you understood these tips and thank you for watching my video i will see you in the next lecture thank you